This will involve Apple Script, which is not that easy. I'd recommend that you don't change any of the scripts as you if you don't have experience in it. Okay, so I've put the Apple Scripts in the download link. So what you're gonna need to do is open up the first one and it will look something like this. So what you're gonna want to do is go file save as and the name of it, so I'm gonna call this iTunes playing uh, what make sure you have no spaces in the name and go on to your favourites it should be automatically here and as we've got the geek tool file make a geek tool file in your favourites and add it there and add this script into it so I'm going to save that into it ok so you do this with every script and now all you need to do is you open up a, a geek tool and you get a new shell so what you need to do is open up the main page which is not coming up for me it's not good and right so you get a new shell Geek Tool would like to open up, would you? And um, you get a new shell and you type this in. Right. So you type in, let me just open up text edit for you. And I will show you what to type in to the command line. So basically, what you need to type in it's the command line is this. Let me make it big. O S A script space. Make sure that space is in there. It won't work for some weird reason. And then you put user and your username so your username and then you put geek tool the file that you made make sure there's no space in it and then the script that you just made so it would be iTunes for me I saved it as iTunes playing dot and then you put dot s SCPT and then you're pretty much done when you put that into the properties of it and it will come up here you can click and drag it to wherever you want and it will come up with what it is you do the same with every other script with different names and basically you're done then and you should have this little widget or whatever you want to call them and you just slide back and it will show you what you're playing and what the time if you've done all the scripts that you want you can also edit the scripts but I recommend not unless you have like if you're an editor basically so watch how I made these if you haven't already just go to my other video the link is here and the next tutorial will be the battery and the weather so the battery and the weather are here the next tutorial will be then. It's very it's gonna be a very short tutorial. So yeah. Peace out.